come in here for this. This guy's dick was so big that when he wore, uh, we wore camo, uh, what the fuck are this? Cargo shorts. We're camo cargo shorts. You could see his shit just hanging right in there. And uh, me and my brother called him HC, as in horse cock. And when we used to go to LA Lifting Club, God rest his soul, by the way, the guy has passed away, so that's very unfortunate. But he would ask us if we wanted to lift off all the time. And we were like, no, no, we're good. We're good. My brother got a lift off from one time, and the guy's dicks like hit my brother in the hat. I was like, ah, oh, can't see. So today, I have my homie, my bestie. I'm uh, 40 years old and I still have a best friend. It sounds weird, right? It sounds really weird to say that, but I'm very fortunate and very lucky to have this man in my corner. I'm very excited to have my boy Jesse Burdick here with us today. He's a coach at uh, CSA, been so for a long time been a good friend for many many moons I don't even know for how long but it's been too long maybe even perhaps <laughs> and uh, today we also have David Uziel is that how you say his name I think so Uziel I think that's how we say his name he's banging out some bench pressing over there as you can see we are uh, very fortunate to know this man because this is the guy who's carting us around he owns a uh, car service and uh, he's the one who is uh, giving us lifts, giving us rides when we're traveling out to things like the Arnold Classic. Uh, you, Mr. Cameraman, you will experience the services as well. Uh, but we were lucky enough to have David's uh, car service towed us around when we were in Pennsylvania, out in the middle of nowhere. Took us all the way to Dana Lynn and Rob Bailey's gym. And uh, it's great to have him here in the gym today. And it's also great to see that he's uh, very much into lifting. He's somebody who follows the podcast. so. A lot of these things in here that seem like they sort of just happen, they don't really just happen, they happen because Super Training's been here for a very long time and we've been kicking out the knowledge for a very long time. In addition to that, we have the PowerCast. David is a fan of the PowerCast and so he was drawn in by that. But other people we have in here have been people that have trained in the gym that have then become employees, such as Marcus, who's over there. And right next to him is Jessica. And in the middle of the gym here, we got my boy, Silent Mike. You guys know his story. Everybody in here has come to this gym and then become part of it, such as our cameraman, who's uh, come here from University of Davis from a seminar, I think, that we maybe had here, or a workshop of sorts. Uh, Andrew, our other uh, photo our photographer and other uh, film guy, he's also come in when we had a bodybuilding.com workshop and then turned into uh, him working for us as well. Little Smokey, he was training with, for, with us for a long time, and uh, he had a pretty good job working on the trains. And uh, I said, you know what? We got to figure out a way to get you out of that gig. You need more time to spend in the gym and more time to hang out with us. And so we took him from that, and now he works here with us. So everything in here at Super Training Gym, a lot of it's because of you guys, because of all the people that are following and watching, and then even the people that have, that have worked inside this very building are people that are just like you guys who are fans and then turned into employees. Super training was super smelly, 
and Smokey were very nice to me. It was a lot of fun. Talk to you tomorrow. Love, Jesse. What ha I have no idea. I've been, I'm really drunk, so I don't remember anything. No, we came up with um, my guy Dave here, just to take, have him um, get a feel for the culture up here at Super Training. Um, and uh, I tagged along because, you know, it's, it's been like a week since I've been here. So I gotta get up here and see everybody. Um, got to pull a little bit, do some speed pulls with Smelly. Um, Dave got to experience uh, both ST and also the slingshot for the first time. Worked up to 315 for a triple, which is really, really good for him. Um, worked on a little bit of technique with Smokey and Smelly. Um, did a little bit of squatting. And now, um, you know, it's putting out the vibe, if you know what I mean.